or 147. Whoa. Maker drones. We saw that in uh, multiplayer. Oh, he's one of those guys. Oh, not, not good. <laughs> not the greatest start. That was weird. That's going to be really hard to kill him with a bunch of other people around. Whoa! Is this a good BFG area? Probably not. Does it anyway. I think I need to, like, force myself to fight him. I don't know if I can clear the rest. Oh, the dog. There's, like, nothing for me to really heal off of right now. Ah! Yeah, I can't kill her either. This might be our chance. Is he alone? really difficult. I need ammo. We have the barrels so we can hunt. Aw. <laughs> Come on! Ah, that's so sad. What sad what a sad way to go down. Alright.
What a sad way to go down. That, that little trap there. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. It's so fast. Ah, oh, whoops. I, I can kill something. There we go. Alright, let's see if we can take this guy. Come on, buddy. Where are you? I need more shotgun ammo. Where is he? Whoa. Didn't want to be there. Oh, bullshit. Ah! That was so close. Whew. Is this our hardest challenge to date? This gate is disgusting. That scream of anguish. Ah! 
Holy shit. This is where we're really good, right? Pretty sure. Come on. Shit, that was close. I don't think Plasma does anything to his shields. We know what we need to do to beat him. It's just I have to execute it, you guys. <laughs> That's all. It's just hard. Get me away from that. I gotta kill this dog ASAP. There we go. I think that thing is what's dealing the most damage to me. Consistently. And the dude at the end, obviously. I think they got another uh, big guy in. Where is he? The teleporter. There he is.
<laughs> All right. Oh, that's a problem. Wow. Is this like another phase that we've never even reached before? Oh, excellent. Excellent. This is like... Never ending. Oh, what? Oh, I got him. Please be the end. Holy moly. Guys, that took me like an hour? I can't believe it. That is bananas. That is absolute bananas. <sighs> 162. Not bad. There will be more. <laughs> I feel like uh, we, we kind of like out of here we hit like a plateau where we were just like absolutely crushing and then uh this gate this gate oh sound of silence thank you so much man dr loic hello nice to meet you <laughs> zero deaths yeah it's true we didn't even die I'm curious, or I, I'm really curious for other people playing on Nightmare, what their death counts would be. And I'm just curious. Because uh, in a lot of ways, it's it reminds me of, um, it reminds me of Dark Souls and Bloodborne, where it's like that persistence, and you're like, you'll fight a boss for maybe an hour, hour and a half sometimes. And then you finally push through. Man, that's just... That's just bananas, dude. It's insane. 
It's insane. Okay, so BFG we can't upgrade. Let's go movement speed in the turret mode that we don't use a lot. <laughs> and then we'll grab uh, recharge time for the shield part. Oh. Wonder how many people keep track of deaths. Oh, not many, I would imagine, unless you're like streaming or something. Uh, it's mostly just fun, like, just something to compare. Compare your wiener size, you know? Sometimes you gotta do that. It's weird, I don't know. I don't know why people do it. Hmm. I feel like if I drop down there, that's gonna be a problem. There's a drop there, too. Maybe at that console? Hmm. You guys think we have to go through? That's where we found the record. I just really don't want to have to come back and do this level again if I don't pick this up right now. <laughs> I don't want to fight that section ever again. Ever. Oh, right. That was a Slayer Gate. That's true. That's true. Thanks, Kermal. Yeah, it's fun. I feel like the sweet spot for uh, videos, though, and maybe stream... Ah, streaming's a bit different. But definitely for videos, I think ultraviolence is probably the way to go. Yeah, that is why we have fast travel. That's true. Mm, I don't think we can climb in there. There's no way in above, and I can't even see, like... An entry point. But, yeah, we can fast travel back. Oh, here. It'll probably be here, won't it? <laughs> yeah. I'm just so paranoid about missing stuff. I need to blow off one more arm, too. The Doom Slayer. His power, FOMO. Yeah, his no, exactly. To overcome. These are the lies hey, of Fuzz. The thanks, man. I guess I don't get the shower again today. I'm sorry, Mal. I'm charting a flight path. <laughs> I'm sorry I'm impacting your personal hygiene. Launching in three, two, one. Planetary entry phase. Prepare for turbulence. It's weird to say, but I feel like if we were on ultraviolence, we'd just stomp our way through. You'd still feel badass. It's a different... It's a different vibe. What difficulty do you guys play on when you're playing on your own? The law of city of the dead is before your time. Sentinels. The slip gate will take you to Sentinel Prime where the priest is hiding. Ultraviolence, nightmare. That's so sick. Lost city of Hedith. Amidst the long and enduring history of Sentinel civilization, there are moments in antiquity that have become buried in time, forgotten chapters that remain concealed to Sentinel historians, waiting to be unearthed. The fallen city of Hebeth 
is one such tale, all but forgotten to the tombs of Legacy's past, once a prosperous port city, a proud gleaming marker of conquest for the distant tribe of Bethian clansmen of the Outer Worlds. Hebeth bridged the disparate sentinel cities with the ingenious design of Slipgate Invention. But it was not meant to last, and among those cities lost in the Crusades of Sentinel Pass was Hebeth, now little more than a smoldering rune swallowed by the quaking surface of a once habitable Mars. <clears throat> you swapped to Nightmare last time because, yeah, I wasn't dying too much in Ultraviolence. Yeah, I feel like, um, besides, like, a, a few key moments in the previous game, like, most of our kills came in, like, just batches of trying to defeat, like, a certain area. And I, that's the same here, but what I'm saying is outside of that, you're, there's just way less chance of dying. Whereas I definitely feel threatened almost all the time in here. Almost all the time. The Grenade emits a second, larger, non-damaging explosion that falters demons. Takes less time to, for cooldown. Let's do cooldown. Yeah, we need a Mancubus here bad. Found him. I'm gonna die here, probably looking at him. There it is. This looks to be the more uh, traditional vibe. We gotta turn this up. Oh, he's not dead. Mode of ammo, excellent. Excellent. Rare moment where you get to stand still. He's stuck! His head's too big! Nice. There's a one up there. Didn't get it.
I see him. My old nemesis. this. Ah, frick. Where is he? There he is. Whoa. He's in phase two. <laughs> Ooh, not done yet. We're done now. Okay. I wonder if I have to use this, or can I save it? Answers that question. Whoa. <laughs> the portal ahead. Are we 100% right now? We're 100%. Take you to Sentinel Prime, where the Hell Priest Dave Grav is waiting. Wow, guys. Okay. I can't believe how long we've we been playing. Six hours? This game just, just, the time just flies by. Yeah, okay. We're gonna be shutting her down.
Doing those Slayer Gates on this difficulty takes so much time. Sentinel Prime. You've traveled through the core of Mars, arriving at the ancient city of Sentinel Prime. You have sovereignty in this unholy place. Dot, 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 dot. That's four dots. Usually, usually only three dots. That's a four dot. The Great Slayer was once a warrior king in this world. Tradition grants you safe passage, but the completion of your mission will come at a price. Hell Priest Grav is awaiting. Whoa. Look at those abs. The Doomicorn armor would look sweet. I know. I know. Alright, guys. Uh, I think we'll wrap it up here for today. And then uh, when we come back, it looks like we're going to fight that last um, priest guy. That'll be tomorrow. So we'll start off heavy. And then I don't... I, I think we're probably only, what, like, we're probably not even two-thirds of the way through the game. 